Look at the front where it says Ames real big. Greetings everybody from Greensboro, North Carolina. Hey, we are at Sears today and this is a standalone Sears and it's at its special own plaza, the Sears Plaza. And this store is so nice. They updated the signage outside and it's pretty clean inside, I'll say. We were we were in this store a year ago and that's where Kayla got that infamous yellow and black sweater, but yeah, it was, we really liked it here. The only reason I didn't do a video then was for two reasons. One, we didn't know they closed at 6 p.m. And it was like, I think, like quarter after five or so when we were here. And I'm like, I don't want to rush. And I'm too tired. And plus, we had to drive back to Pittsburgh. And I said, we'll come back. And thankfully, they didn't close this one. And we, we thought we had seen reports of it closing. But clearly, it's not because here we are to do a video of it under normal circumstances and check it out. So without further ado, let's go ahead and do that. Mm. <laughs> Wanna taste my blue hair? Oh, I got a nice dose of glasses right in the oh. eye. <laughs> well, anyway, you'll get to see it from a bird's eye point of view since I only got one eye left. All right, let's go check it out. <laughs> you hurt <Okay>. me. <laughs> All right, here we are at Sears, good old Greensboro Sears. It's a standalone store. It's in its own plaza. It's called the Sears Plaza. I'll show you the sign here in just a second. This place is awesome. I love the Sears. Everybody here is so sweet. Mm-hmm. This is where Kayla got her my black infamous, and yellow sweater. Yep, my her, infamous sweater. The infamous sweater. All right, let's check out the sign and then go inside. Yep, there is their Sears Plaza sign with Sears and Sears Auto Center and Lands End. I think Lands End left, though. But yep, that's their signage for the place. I like that. Sears Plaza. With the updated lettering. And then they felt the need to put the sign underneath it for the store. Now my question is, when this store closes, because unfortunately you know eventually it will, as the company is on literally a skeleton crew anymore of stores. There's only, I think, like 20 to 30 Sears stores left in the country at this point. So when the inevitable happens, and I don't want it to, I, I don't want it to, what are they going to do with the name of it? Is it still going to be called Sears Plaza or are they going to change the name? I think it would be kind of neat to leave it Sears Plaza for the history sake of it. But anyway, that's the plaza sign. There is a Whole Foods here, as you can see, and then there's the beautiful Sears right there. They even have their own Sears Auto Center, which is actually really nice compared to most that we've seen. It's updated with newer signage. Now, I imagine it's still open, even though the doors are papered up. I don't know. But I thought it was, unless they just recently closed it. I don't know, but they left all the signage up. But either way, they had one here. It looks like it's open, because there's a bunch of cars parked down there. And it's pretty nice. All right, let's go inside and see what's cooking in here. Mm-hmm. They do have the best jeans. Sears doesn't look too bad. <laughs> Looks pretty good in here. Pretty nice. There aren't many left. I'm not sure. Isn't this the last one in North Carolina? Uh, I don't even know. Wow, shoes are empty. What does it say? Please excuse our mess. We are improving our shoe department to better serve you. I sure hope so. Because it doesn't look so good. Yeah, this place is 
It's emptying out a little bit though. Just a little bit. Alrighty. Hey, that's cool. I like when that happens. Mm -hmm. That was fun. <laughs> I like the waffle pants and mm -hmm. burger pants. <laughs> that's a large store. It's just. Mm hmm. Can I take the tent? Can I have the tent? This is the tent I'm talking about, guys. <laughs> yep, there's our doorway. And they got lots of pool tables. They're not bad. They're they're cheap in price too. They're just not regulation size. I haven't seen a pool table in years a long time. Yeah, this one got a lot. They actually have quite a amount of patio furniture too. Not a whole lot, but I do like what they have, especially the bar right here. That bar is really cool. I do like that a lot. Not bad though. Do you want a Carolina Panthers shirt? Mm. Kayla? No. <laughs> no? <laughs> I like the colors, but. I hear ya. Oh, okay. The colors are nice, yeah. I'm Steelers all day though. Okay. This is my alley here with the tolls and the toll boxes. They just don't have a lot. And now that summer's here, well, almost here, grills. I like the real large one there. Not bad. But yeah, they have tool boxes. This, is, well, this one isn't bad, this Craftsman one. But they have a lot. They used to have so much more though. Mm -hmm. Actually what's funny is I need a 14 millimeter deep well socket. If I see any, I'm gonna grab one. I actually snapped one in half and it's from Mac and we haven't dealt with Mac toll reps in so long. I don't wanna wait anymore. I love the old registers still, still rocking strong. Right, let's go upstairs and see what they have. Hmm. Cool. All right, so we get upstairs. appliances and men's clothing well, wow they really they definitely are low on stock though that's for sure if you take a look around they got a lot of appliances though yeah not as many as they used to have though i really thought this one I, I swore someone had said this one was closing, though. I saw it on the list. Yeah. I saw it on the list. Well, thankfully not. Well, at least not yet, anyway, but... Yeah, I don't think they're getting them like, back here. Well, they got stuff down there, too. But, yeah. Nice-looking store, anyway. Nice-looking store. restrooms. Baños. <laughs> A lot of mattresses. They're insanely priced though. A couple thousand dollars for a mattress. Hmm. Nice pillows. Yeah, maybe not. Oh, they closed a section off. This wasn't closed off before. Not that I remember. Hmm. Yeah, definitely not closed off before.
So I wasn't gonna do a restroom review, but this one's too clean not to. I came in here and I mean, look at that. This is nice for Sears. I approve, but look at this. For a restroom, for Sears, it's well lit. It's very clean in here. And I mean, very clean. Now you could tell everything's been sanitized in here. So whoever's taking care of this, you're doing a great job, I'll say that. Even the handicap stall. Well stocked, yeah, well done, well done. Oh, that's, that's soap in there. Yeah, so, not bad. Gear shots would approve. <laughs> Everything though, look how spotless this is. Pretty, pretty good. Two thumbs up, I can't, I can only do one, but look, on the mirror, doing two. <laughs> Let's go back out into the store. <laughs> it's mattress warehouse in here. Look how many they have. And it's good, but prices are a little high for mattresses, honestly, considering we just bought a new one ourselves. And I got it at Big Lots for considerably less. We're talking like $600 after tax. Not even, it was like $550 after tax. But still, I mean, not bad. These are comfortable though. Anyway, let's continue. <laughs> Hybrid. Wow. Hmm. Wow. Yeah, this is all kids' clothing up here besides the men's clothing back there. But I remember you found that sweater, it was up here. Actually, look, there, there's like a few like, little sweaters and stuff back here. Yeah? Cool, take a look. Okay, well. Pants. Okay. Cool. Hmm. Wow. And they closed that whole section off here too. That's weird. That's weird. Just that little section that well the fitting room's back there too. So that's probably why. But still. See, and you know, I say what I say about Sears and Eddie Lamper closing them, but when we go to Sears, we always have good luck finding stuff, and such is the case with these cargo shorts. Yeah. I was looking for these at another one. They didn't have my size here. They do, and I'm pretty happy, and even she found some clothing. We found some, we found some pants for work, so. So it's a win-win. Work and everyday use. Uh-huh, and we're supporting the company, yeah. even though Eddie doesn't support the company, his own company. Oh, well, we're happy Screw campers. Eddie. Yeah, screw you, Eddie, but still, we're happy campers making a purchase. Here's their fitting rooms. Closed off. When it was last checked. March. Probably of last year. Love the escalator and staircase. It looks so nice. Very nice. Hmm. Yeah. And I guess with that, that'll be everything from inside of the Sears. But if I turn around, then you get a good view of the staircase. I like it. Okay, now that the video's over, my vision has come back in this eye and I can see again. I'm sorry. <laughs> These are his sunglasses, actually. I, was I know. Done and left my home. That's okay. We wear them around the house sometimes when it is bright out, or like not in the house, but when we're in the car. Yeah, I wear them in the house. <laughs> but no, anyway, uh, 
we were wearing them the other day when we were out and about around Pittsburgh. And yeah, I remember you cute. wore them into the house. That's fantastic. Here, you want this pair too? Go for a trifecta. Mm -hmm. These um, are my real glasses. Let's open these up and there, go for those too. <laughs> I can't even see. I bet. You look ridiculous. The glasses Good. stick like four inches off of your face. <laughs> Hold on, let me... There you go. Oh, you're cute. No. Yes, you are. Alright, this is cool. Okay. So... <laughs> Don't try to, like, ruin my style. Don't kill my vibe. Oh, yeah. So, I definitely... I'm so jealous of that. Hot. Mm -hmm. Hot. <laughs> anyway, we're going to take off from this Sears. We hope you enjoyed our look around the store. And shout out to our friend Jack, who we happened to meet in here. We were in here, we were shopping around and doing our video, and we got run into by a fan. And uh, well, it was really nice to meet you yeah, and your family. Easy. It was really nice. And I'm sorry you met me when I was wearing workout clothes. <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't look decent. You look fine. You're wearing that Chewy shirt, which Chewy's is a very good restaurant. But anyway, no, it was nice meeting you and your family, and we really appreciated uh, the kind words and hanging out with you guys for a moment. And my six eyes agree. <laughs> and my one. <laughs> but anyway, we're going to take off. We have a long drive back home to Pittsburgh, unfortunately. And I, I hate... got work in the morning, so do you. Yeah, and I, I just, I hate leaving North Carolina. North Carolina is such a beautiful and wonderful state. I want to live here so badly. I can't even. I can't even stress that enough. But who knows what will happen in the future? Nags head. Next trip to the uh, North Carolina area. Nags head. That'd be nice for the summer. When anyway. that fourth stimulus hit. <laughs> and my tax return. <laughs> no. Um, now, if we really wanted to, I'd just have to save up for it, like I've done in the past. Not a big deal. Anyway. Hope you enjoyed. It's such a beautiful day out here. We want to enjoy sunny North Carolina a little bit longer before we have to head home. So with that said, take care. Stay awesome, everybody. Have a serious glasses delicious day. <laughs> and we'll talk to you later. Bye, everyone. Bye.